Deepfake videos impersonating, in this case, like the one you see here, Elon Musk, have become one of the most noticeable online threats of late. But in recent months, it's been thousands of AI-powered deepfake videos that have surfaced, leading to billions of dollars in fraud. Yeah, because it can be hard to tell the difference. Tonight, iTeam reporter Brian New brings you a warning and an in-depth inside look at the technology that is now fueling a new wave of scams. Hello, my name is Elon Musk. Today I would like to introduce you to Quantum AI. I saw it on Facebook, and then I saw it on TikTok. Do you want to earn from $5,000 a month? And then I thought, well, you know, this might be a true, a real thing. Heidi Swan, a 62-year-old healthcare worker, thought she was making a smart investment because who better, she thought, to take financial advice from than one of the richest people in the world. So did it look like Elon Musk? Looked just like Elon Musk, sounded just like Elon Musk, and I thought it was him. And so Swan contacted the company behind the pitch and opened an account for more than $10,000. You thought you were investing in cryptocurrency. Right. But Swan had been scammed. Her money vanished, taken by a new wave of high-tech thieves who are using artificial intelligence to turn real videos into fakes and make fake videos look real. Don't miss this incredible opportunity to change your life and help others in the process. At the University of North Texas in Denton, Professor Christopher Murdo is also using artificial intelligence, but he's using it to create art. AI, it's not going to replace the creative arts, but it's going to just uh, augment them and, and change the way that we understand the things that we can do within the sphere of, of creativity. Murdo sees this technology as a way to be innovative, but also sees its dangers. A good sign as to whether there is free speech. Murdo showed us how scammers can take a real video, like this one of Elon Musk, then using AI tools, cut out his mouth and voice, and replace them with edited lip-syncing technology. Today we are launching an investment project that is working right now if you see this video. Murdo says advances in the technology are making it easier and easier to create a deepfake video. In fact, he says one can be made with just a single still image and by recording a video. So we asked Professor Mirdo if he could take this video and swap out my face and voice for that of Elon Musk's, and this is what he came up with. I could say I know how to make you incredibly rich, or I guarantee you that the Dallas Cowboys will win the Super Bowl this year. These AI-generated videos are hardly perfect, but they just need to be convincing enough to deceive an unsuspecting victim. It's cool technology, but that's, that's scary at the same time when you think about what, what people can do with it. Yeah, yeah, if you're really trying to scam people, I think you could do some, some pretty bad things with this. According to a leading financial research group, AI-generated content contributed to more than $12 billion in fraud losses last year and could reach $40 billion in the U.S. by 2027. This year, both the FTC and the FBI issued warnings that deep fake scams are on the rise. So once you realized that this was a scam, did you go back and watch any of these videos? I did. I went back and watched them, but even though going back and watching them, they still look like Elon Musk. They still sound like Elon Musk. I didn't know it could be as real as that, and it is. A study by an AI firm found that Elon Musk is the most common celebrity used in deepfake scams. We reached out to Elon's team and are waiting to hear back. Doug, one of the reasons that we see so many deepfake videos involving Elon Musk is not only is he incredibly rich, but he does a lot of interviews. And the more content you have of someone online, the easier it is to make a deepfake video. Yeah. And you point out that they're not all perfect, right? But any advice for people on how to protect right. themselves from these kind of videos? Yeah, so sometimes, Doug, there are obvious signs. You know this from looking at some. There could be some odd 
body movements, um, lip syncing that's a little off. But as this technology improves, it's going to be harder and harder to spot it with just simply looking at it, which is why it is so important to slow down and ask yourself, who posted this and what are they asking for? We've also found there's a growing number of websites that claim that they can detect a deep fake. So the I-team put these online tools to the test and tomorrow night at 10, we'll share with you the results. Look forward to seeing that because uh, sometimes there can be yeah. a scam on top of the scam. You never know.